So today is a scary day, and this is the first day the subscription payments come in for Chat IQ. This is probably the biggest challenge I've ever faced. Hundreds of customers who are on the free trial aren't able to, we're not able to collect their payments. Everything I've done over the last eight months has been leading up to this moment. And then that's going to continue and it will scale to about three, five hundred dollars a day average over the next week. Some of those people may fail, those payments may not go through, so it will be a very tense couple of days. In the last two weeks, I've got over half a million views on TikTok and let's just say it's been completely overwhelming. And that, that's just complete disaster, I don't even want to think about that. So, this is it. This is launch day. But, I'm not going to lie to you. The only way I can describe how I feel today is anxious. Everything that happens today will shape the future of ChatIQ. See, I built the system for accepting payments myself, and I'm worried I've missed something. Everything I've done over the last eight months has been leading up to this moment. I have over 300 trialing users. This gives me the potential to make anywhere between $5,000 and $30,000 every single month. If you've been watching this series, you'll know Chat IQ is fully bootstrapped and I'm not a technical founder. Since launch, I felt on a back foot. I don't know how to code, so everything's new to me. And in five seconds, the first payment will be charged. Okay, so <laughs> pretty stressful so far. The first payment was supposed to come in about an hour or so ago. That payment went into draft which it's not supposed to do, it's supposed to just automatically charge the customer. Um, and then an hour later it collects upon that invoice and it didn't go through. There was an issue with the card not being able to be used for subscription payments, which could mean that the whole system for these free trials isn't working and hundreds of customers who are on the free trial aren't able to, we're not able to collect their payments. Um, and that, that's just complete disaster, I don't even want to think about that. We've got another one coming up in about eight minutes, so we'll see what happens for that one. But yeah, this is not the situation I want to be in. Eight months of work, risk, worry and stress, all leading up to this point, and I failed. I've run businesses before, and I've dealt with stuff like this before, but this time it's different. This was always meant to be the dream, and now it may never happen. I really needed this to work out. This is the biggest failure I've ever faced. Right now, I feel more lost than I've ever felt. However much I want to just scream and walk away in anger at myself, I know right now the only thing to do is keep a cool head and work my way through this. I think now all I can really do is see if there's a way to fix this. Okay, when I say I'm nervous, I'm really nervous. The payment was supposed to come in a minute ago. Nothing's happened. Uh, it says. It came through. It came through. I think it came through. Yes. 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 <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. It came through. Oh, that is the first. Exactly. That is the first customer. First customer. The that first is. The first child I'm actually shaking. And it worked. First ever paying customer for Chat IQ. There is no way I can express in words the relief and happiness I feel right now. I'm genuinely overjoyed. Everything in the last eight months has been leading up to this moment. And if any of you have ever felt that feeling of getting your first customer for a business that you've worked hard on for months, you'll know exactly how I feel right now. So I think I can probably start to relax and look forward to the future. The rest of the day just keeps going well. So, as I sit in the bar at the end of the day and try to wind down, the last few payments are coming in. Now today was definitely a roller coaster. But for now, here are the final numbers for the first day of launch, 26th of April, 2023. In the next episode, I'm probably gonna face some of the biggest challenges yet. But I had 206 new users sign up for the app, 36 active subscribers, and £124 collected. Over the following five days leading up to the end of the month of April, I bought on another 1,421 new users, 85 active subscribers, and a monthly recurring revenue of over £1,300.